Right, welcome back in. Well, happening Saturday, Birmingham's premier young professionals uh, organization, uh, they are having their event, the Black and White Ball, and it's their main event of the year. It raises money for Rotorback Club of Birmingham's nonprofit branch. And, of course, you can be a part of it. Dwayne Jones is joining us to talk about the 15th annual event. Good morning to you, Dwayne. Great morning, Tori. How are you? Good, good. good well, Dwayne, let me you. just put a disclosure. Dwayne is one of my, my friends. So uh, This is my good friend. Thank good you for having us. Yes, and, uh, a good guy, of course, here in community. Uh, he's coordinating this event. Uh, talk about what the black and white ball is. Well, first of all, thank you and great morning to you and everybody here. We're glad to be here. Uh, the Foundation Ball is our largest fundraising ball for the Rotaract Club of Birmingham. We promote literacy throughout the Birmingham City School System, so this is our largest found fundraiser where we're able to do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the black and white ball course, uh, you know, a chance for those who I haven't worn a tuxedo all season long. So if you want... Me neither, but, you know, I can give you some tips. I know oh, you're good on dressing. Oh, wow. I can give you some tips. I wish we had a close-up right now. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, uh, for those who, who, who do, of course, you can only wear black or white to this ball, right? You can wear black and white. We really encourage that. You can put a spouse of color in it if you want to, but we do encourage you to wear black and white. What can people expect at the actual ball? Great question. So we can expect a lot of community development networking for people and um, DJ Bandcamp, who is the official DJ for the NBA, will be there with us to provide entertainment. Our mayor will be there. You will be there. I will be there. So we just have great entertainment for everybody and we'll be honoring our Hall of Famers for the Rotaract Clubs of mm -hmm. Jefferson County and some of those great people who've been doing a lot of work in the Jefferson County area. Now, you guys have hundreds of people already coming to the event. Unfortunately, you got some bad news for those who are watching right now. Before, now when we booked this interview, this wasn't the case, but this right. just happened, I believe, the, yesterday. Yesterday. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, we sold out. We have over 600 tickets sold. Wow. So we definitely still want people to be able to know that they can be impactful in this event by donating to Rotaract Club of Birmingham. How can people donate to Rotaract? They can log on to Eventbrite and they can look up the Foundation Ball for 2023, Rotaract Club of Birmingham. It's the first thing that'll come up and you'll be able to donate toward these literacy programs for the city of Birmingham. So yeah, now very quickly, you know, you say the literacy programs and some of the work around Birmingham. Uh, talk about what uh, Rotaract itself is for those who don't know what Rotaract is. Great question. So Rotaract Club of Birmingham is the largest professional development network for young professionals in the city of Birmingham, age 35 and younger. So a lot of people who are in the professional sector of Birmingham, young professionals of all arenas, really come together in Rotaract to help provide those services for our community. All right, Rotaract Foundation Ball, black and white ball, is happening Saturday night. I believe we have that information. We can bring it up on the screen really quickly. It is starting at, uh, I believe, 7 p.m.? 6.30. 6.30 p.m. 6.30 p.m. Doors open then. Uh, wear your white and black, and it's going to be a good old time, huh? Absolutely, absolutely. All right, thank you very much, Dwayne Jones no from Rotaract. You. Russell Jones, Russell Jones, Dwayne Jones, Russell Jones. That's something to talk about, might be cousins. <laughs>